Now I'm not covering how to uh, code your Access database with Visual Basic application code, but if you want to prevent unauthorized users from deleting, editing, or copying your VBA code, this is how you do it. Come up here, click on the Database Tools tab, go to the Macro Group, click on Visual Basic, then come up here, click on Tools, and go down to, well, Mines Database 1 Properties, click on it, go to the Protection tab, and then check Lock Project for Viewing. And for the password, go ahead and type in a password. I'm going to keep it simple so I can remember it. Pass, pass, and then click OK. Then we can come up here, click on File to close and return to our Access database. And then if we close out and later on, let me go ahead and double click and open it up again. My folder, there it is, Integration, double click. And I want to go ahead and remove it. Then it's the same place again. Database Tools to Visual Basic. Tools to Database 1 Properties. And there we go. Got to have the password to be able to have access to it. And to even remove the password, let's go ahead and type it in. Hit enter. We can go to the protection tab. Delete the uh, password. Go ahead and uncheck lock for viewing. Click OK. And we're back to where we started. It's no longer protected. But you can see that without that password, nobody can delete your code, edit, or copy it. And then file and close and return back to our Microsoft Access database here. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel to get notified of the latest videos. And for great specials on my products, please see the description below this video.